I'm Coach Mark here, and I hope you guys are having an absolutely fabulous, amazing week. Matter of fact, I know you guys are having an absolutely fabulous and amazing week. Well, this week, I want to share with you a story. It's a story about two geese and a frog, all right? Two geese and a frog. Now, these geese and the frog are up north, and everybody knows that lives up north that once it gets to the winter month, it gets very, very, very cold up north. So what do birds and geese do? They always, you always hear this in the stories, they fly south for the winter. So these two geese were getting ready to fly south for the winter, and the frog says to them, please, please do not leave me here. It gets way too cold in the winter, and I can't go out, I can't find food, I can't enjoy myself. Please, can you guys take me with you? So the geese look at each other, and then they look at the frog. Are you crazy? How are we going to take you with us? We can't fly you on our backs. You're way too heavy. How do you suppose that we take you with us? So, you know, the, the geese had kind of made up their mind that they were just going to fly. They were going to leave the frog. But the frog says, please, 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 we'll figure out a way. So the frog is hopping around, hopping around, hopping around, and he sees this stick. So the frog says to them, hey, I got an idea. I got an amazing idea. Why don't you guys grab the sticks with your beak and um, each end of the stick, and then I will grab in the middle of the stick with my mouth. I'll use my mouth to clench the middle of the stick. So the geese kind of look at each other and say, you know what? That idea may could work. All right, we'll go ahead and try that. So the geese put the stick in their mouth, right, on each side, and in the middle, the frog used his mouth to clench the middle of the stick. So they fly up in the air and they're flying. So as they're flying down south, everybody's just looking with amazement. Everyone's looking like, wow, wow, look at that. That's two geese flying and the frog. Oh my God, that's amazing. So someone yells up to them, hey, that's an absolutely amazing idea. That is so creative. How did you guys, who, first of all, who came up with that idea? And the frog opens his mouth and says, I did. And guess what happens? The frog falls to its death. <laughs> here's, the, here's the moral of that story. First, there's no I in team. So if the frog didn't open his mouth, he wouldn't have fell down, right? He opened up his mouth to take credit and say I. The second moral to that story is don't ever be the first person to take credit when it's a team effort. Now, I hope you guys got something from that story, and I will see you next week.